What is up guys, Tomcat here, and today we are back in Demolition Build Simulator 2018. This is the full game, so we're going to pick up right, right where we left off when we just bought a bulldozer, and then we'll probably go and take on some jobs that require, well, I don't know about require a bulldozer, but we'll definitely, oops, I did not mean to do that. Which is the interact button again? It's F. Right. Alright. Oh god, how do we, how do we, how do we get rid of the radio? Because I'm not really interested in having it on. <laughs> I mean, not like it's an issue, but oh, there we go. We can turn it. Oh, God. So let's see. Let's go ahead and we'll interact with this guy right here. We use this old saloon as a tourist attraction. However, in the state, yeah, we got it. <laughs> we got it. All right. Preparation. Dust control. Uh, some demolition sites require dust control. To decrease dust levels, spray the building with water before the demolition. Pick up the right, the hose and use the alternative fire button or the right mouse button uh, to fire it, I'm assuming. All right. So let's see. Oh, they, they're trying to get us to use a hint for it, but... So we literally have to do this to the whole entire building? Or actually, well, you can visibly see... You can visibly see... Uh, or visibly? Yeah, you can visibly see where the building is wet, so we just basically need to wet down the entire building uh, before we demolish it. So I'm thinking that like once that's all done and we go over it with the bulldozer, it'll be uh, it should be a lot more, lot better controlled than it would be otherwise. So let's go ahead and get everything all sprayed down, and then I'm gonna go ahead and go to the back. Although does it dry off? Seems like it might a little bit, but not enough to where it would matter. Just spray down towards the end there. It should get... It should cover everything. Yeah, it should cover pretty much everything along the along the edge of the building. Alright, so let's go ahead and we'll drop that. Alright. Oh, it, it... Really? Really? And now I'm stuck in here. How many chairs flew out? Just one? Alright. We'll stick that back in there. Oh, will you... For God's sake! Oh my God! All right, that's all done. That's good to go. So now break the windows. What windows? Like, this one? Oh, like, it, they're including, like, the window frames and, and everything. But I feel like, at the same time... Oh, you know what? This is probably all stuff that we have to do, like, just with, you know, with hand tools. Or, like, you know, just picking up the chairs and stuff like that. But the next stage will probably be all with the bulldozer. So I think we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and get the fence first. Once we get the fence all done and out of the way, we'll get the um, we'll get the building itself handled. And I'm thinking once that like I feel like it's a much better way to do it because then you're not having to worry about like do doing you know the building and then having to finish this extra piece on the side. This is like super easy. So I feel like why would you not do this first? All right, so here we go. It's gonna be fun. This is gonna be good. Like, oh, for God's sake. Alright. Boom! Oh, boy. <laughs> there we go. Oh, yes. I'm guessing that the dust control method helped. I wonder how we can get that wall to fall over. It seems like it doesn't want to. I'm also trying not to damage the bulldozer, but at the same time, I mean, I'm kind of like, I really... I don't care too much what happens to it, so I'm like, eh, not really a big deal. Need to get these posts so the roof will fall in. Oh, God. Oh, God, all that dust. All that dust. All that dust. Oh, my God. Woo, that, that, I, I, I was, I was really concerned there for a second that it was about to, it was about to be a major, major problem. I wonder if... I wonder if we pick this up and... Oh, oh, really? Pick that up and then just spray everything down again. Like, spray everything down a second time. I wonder how well that will contr help control everything. Alright, so let's see if that actually did anything. I don't know if it will or not. I'm, I'm very curious to see if it actually did anything. Oh, there's no dust. There's literally, like, none at all. I mean, it's a tiny little bit, but it's, it's, it's small enough, like, it's a small enough amount that it genuinely doesn't matter. 
All right, so let's go ahead and we'll take that post out. And we'll take... Well, I was going to take the other post out, but... Let's go ahead and... Oop, oop, oop. No, I mean, it helps control the dust, but it doesn't necessarily help completely prevent it. So... We do have to wait just a second. Like, just a little bit of time. Until... Oh, really? That was just bad on my part. That was just bad. Get that out of the way. And... Oh, for God's sake, what are you doing? Boy. <laughs> Boy. Alright, let's go ahead and get this out. Really? Alright. <laughs> I can't believe, like, I end up just running square into those things sometimes. Get that out of the way. I, that's, like, not even halfway up, so... That should be... That should be it! Boom! Done! Alright, so let's go ahead and finalize that. And let's see. We'll finalize it and finish. There's a demolition contract done, so including dust cleaning, $225. That's really not much in the grand scheme of what we're doing here. So in terms of tools that we're going to buy next, I kind of want to get that saw, but I don't know where to go and get it because the, oh, we're probably going to get a phone call like any second now, uh, but let's go ahead and get on the map. Garage, renovated shop, old casino. Let's see. Can't get a taxi while in a vehicle. Do you want to set a waypoint? Except, does the airport actually do anything? Like, can you actually go anywhere, or is it just an airport? I, I feel like if it was marked, it would mean something, but I don't know what it, like, I don't know if it would mean anything or not. It, it, we'll have to see. Let's see. Use an airport sign to travel to different places, increasing the company rating while not new. Okay, so, basically, we don't have the ability to travel yet. We will, we just don't have it yet. So, I need to head back to... The area where we are machine shop tool shop um, You know what? You know what? I'm gonna exit the vehicle so I can fast travel Let's see to the machine shop back tool shop except thank you So this should uh, not that <laughs> Let's see jackhammer welder abrasive saw we'll pick up one of these We'll pick up a we'll pick up a jackhammer as well because we'll probably need one. And I'm thinking, hmm. Oh God, <laughs> oh boy, Semtex plastic explosive. That's that's fun. Let's see. Well, welder, maybe fixing machines. Oh, actually, you know what? Yes, that's going to be a good investment because that'll allow us to fix like our bulldozer if it's ever, you know, if we ever break it. Because <laughs> I can see that you know sometimes happening. All right, let's see. Jobs. Uh, Roswall Saloon. Let's see. Uh, sadly, needs to be demolished. So this we now have. So let's see. Set a waypoint. And then now we are going to use a parking spot to deliver our pickup truck here. So, where's my pickup truck? Where's my... Boy! I was like, where's my pickup truck? Alright, let's go. Hopefully it's not too far away. I wish the GPS would really, like, show you... Give you a better idea of distance. I mean, well, I mean, they, they kind of do. They say, oh, it's a thousand meters. But, at the same time, that thousand meters is just like... It, it's like... The way you calculate distance changes for every game, so it... Oh, God, don't tell me it's going to rock glitch, like, spin tires. Like, or, well, spin tires or spin tires modern or what, or what, whichever one. I was like, please, I've had my fair share of experience with the rock glitch. I don't need it again. Who are you? Let's see. There's an underground reservoir pipe infrastructure that we need to remove. We can do most of the job, but the rest of our team will arrive next week. In the meantime, somebody has to clean up the site. All right. We knew that. I mean... It's demolition. We, we can we can get that under control. So cut pipes and push old campers off the cliff. That seems like a that seems like a totally safe and friendly way to uh, to get rid of these old campers. So where are the oh the pipes are over here? All right. Oh, I see what they mean. All right, so they're down in here. Metal saw tutorial. You can you can use a metal saw to cut. Specific metal objects. To cut vertically, hold the left mouse button. To cut horizontally, hold the right. Oh. Well, that's not bad. 
I'm thinking... Oh, I see. I, you know what it is? I'll tell you exactly what it is. Basically, anything that's look that looks mildly rusty can be cut out. Oh, would you aim in the right spot, please? Like, oh, you can actually get them from down here. Oh, wow, I didn't think you could. That would have literally, like, fallen on my head and taken me the hell out if I if that was real life, dude. Like, holy crap. We got a couple back here. I, it's weird because you keep... They're so easy to miss. I bet you I probably missed a whole bunch back in the starting area. I'll get the right tool. Just jump down freaking, like, air attack. These metal pipes. Alright, so 43 out of 43, done. Finally. Finally done. So we can go ahead and get... We can go ahead and get ourselves back up here to the top. And we'll get... Oop. God, we'll get our bulldozer and push all of the campers off the cliff because again, like I said, that's perfectly 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 safe and uh and 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 respected and ethically uh fine. <laughs> all right, let's go. It's a little bit dark out, but it should still be fun. This thing should have all the grip and power to go up a hill too. Although, actually, I am going to repair it. Let's see, four. I should just use that. Oh, it's already back up to 100. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I figured it needed more than that, but... Wait, off the cliff as in which... So this cliff over here? Let me just try that. Oh, God, I'm going to be in a... That, that, I mean, that's a cliff, all right. Oh, just don't let yourself go off the cliff. But yeah, no, that's what we need to do. We literally need to push... These campers off the edge of a freaking cliff. Let's see if we can do a bunch together at the same time. So that's one. Get the next one. All right, three at the same time. Let's get these over the edge. It doesn't. It really doesn't like that. It really doesn't like that. Oh, oh, oh! Yes. Goodbye. They're gonna sit there. I mean, I know they're gonna sit there, but I mean, hey, it is what it is. That's what the game told us to do. All right, and take that, and that, and that. <laughs> Even if we push them closer to the wall, it'll make them easier to manage. We'll go ahead and turn around. I love the freaking turning radius of a bulldozer. It's like, it's one of the best things. You're just like, I can turn on a dime anywhere I freaking want. Oh, go, come on. Oh, what is your issue? Seriously? Is just gonna sit there? That's mildly annoying. Alright, let's go ahead and we'll push this guy. Oh, God. Push this guy on ahead. Well, maybe not push that guy on ahead because... Oop, it, well, we got it turned. So now we just gotta actually make it move. And now it's... Hmm. It's all like they're all bunched up with it like together, which means they're not gonna want to move regardless. Yeah, that's it, they're they're not gonna want to move regardless, so they're just gonna sit and like I ugh. come on. There we go. Is that there there's two more? Oh, okay. I was about to say, there's like, where, where'd they all go? I love that there's like, there's so much like, there's so much like, beer and stuff like just scattered everywhere. I mean, like these people were, these people were not the cleanest of 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 residents, that's for sure, or campers, whatever. Not the cleanest campground in the world. One more to do. One more to do. All right, we got this last one, and in fact, oh, uh, I wonder if it'll actually still move since the other one, since we pushed it from up where the hitch is, it freaked out, and it did a whole bunch of weird things. It was like, oh, since you're trying to move me from where the hitch is, I'm not going to move. What the hell? The bulldozer got stuck. That is... Uh-oh. That's scary, because when the bulldozer gets stuck... Oh, I see what happened. And I'm mildly annoyed about it, because now... 
we can't really go anywhere apart from being half stuck in the wall. <laughs> Which is a little annoying, to say the least. Get it? I, I don't care if it hits the wall. I, all I care about is getting this thing over the edge of the cliff. And goodbye, sir. Enter. Boom. Finalize. And done. Alright, that one actually... That, that took a little bit more time than it should have, I think. But hopefully we'll start to get some more jobs that require bigger equipment uh, really, really soon. So, in preparation for the next episode, let's do... Ooh, we could hire somebody as well. Hmm. We'll do that in the next episode. And then, old gas station. We need... Oh, God! We need a bulldozer... Uh, a demo and a demolition robot. So that will definitely be something that we'll take on in the next episode. But if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave me a like. Tell me in the comments down below what you guys thought of it. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for more. I'll see you all next time. Talk to you guys later.